Well, hello, my name is Mark Spur and I'm the CEO of Disability Services Australia. We're an organisation that's been around for about 60 odd years and our sole purpose is to enhance the lives of people with a disability. Cause you're a sky, cause you're a sky full of stars Cause you light up the park and we do this by maximising the opportunities for people with disability to have choice, inclusion and achievement in their home life, in their working life and also in their community life. We provide a range of uh, services in support of people with disabilities and they include accommodation and in-home support, uh, life skill development, social interaction and training through our day options programs. celebrating a club grant that we have received for our Condor Park facility. And this Condor Park facility, that's been around for about 35 years and in fact we employ 150 people within the facility. We provide a range of um, services, mainly around packaging and assembly, and we provide those to commercial enterprises and uh, also for some government contracts as well. We do a really good job. Um, in terms of our customer service, we're, we're applauded for our customer service. We have uh, a very good workforce, very committed workforce, and we're just very, very pleased to be able to have um, our supported employees um, learning new skills, uh, being part of a, a successful team, and uh, also a great social interaction that you get, that everybody gets by going to work. As well in the Bankstown area, we, uh, we support a, a, a many other people with a disability within the district um, and in fact we support about 300 people and uh, in addition to our supported employees at Condor Park, um, we also have day options programs and uh, other supports and uh, within the region as well. We're particularly delighted to have received a club grant this year uh, and this club grant will allow us to refurbish some staff amenities in, our, um, in, in the Condal Park site uh, and specifically uh, we, we're going to modernise our bathroom areas and also we're going to refurbish our kitchen and canteen areas. Now the benefit of this is well obviously much better working conditions for the people that work here but also very importantly with upgrading the kitchen uh, we will have a, a, a bigger area in which uh, that we can um, uh, entertain and to uh, have uh, social interaction with the, the parents of the people that we support, their carers and also the community generally. I'd, I'd particularly like to thank the clubs in the local area. Uh, they've been fantastic supporters for, uh, of DSA over many years, uh, both with in-kind support and also financial support. Um, and it really, uh, really is a wonderful thing that um, the uh, clubs that do have surpluses uh, they share that around into very much needed uh, community support services. So I'd like to thank uh, the management uh, and, and very much the, the members as well. My name is Jenny Lonigan. I'm currently relieving the principal of East Hills Public School. East Hills Public School was established in 1952 and is situated in southwestern Sydney. It caters for a diverse range of socio-economic and cultural backgrounds. The school is also a part of the East Hills Community of Schools, linking closely with East Hills Girls Technology High School and East Hills Boys High School. Currently the school has three support classes catering for students with autism and intellectual disabilities. The grant we applied for is to help assist the uh, school in putting in a multi-sensory playground it allows both the support unit students and the mainstream students to access that facility.
PNC worked closely with myself and the principal and other staff at the school in putting the application together, making sure that it was going to be a grant that would allow the whole school and the local community to benefit. We'd like to take this opportunity to thank Clubs New South Wales Grants and Risby Workers Club for their kind donation to our school's PNC. Kay Davenport. I'm the Vice President of the Management Committee of Coolaroo Neighbourhood Centre. I've been involved with them for the past eight or nine years as a volunteer. I run a group but I also um, help with whatever I can in the centre. The girls work very hard on different projects and the particular projects that we have from Reesby Workers Club is the Picasso. Um, Padstow Picasso art classes for the children um, at age from about 6 to 12 or 14 and they've been, they do uh, introducing them to the arts. Hello, my name's Alison Mills and um, my kids 14 and 12 come to um, a Coolaburoo Community Centre and they have great activities um, for the because they're early teens and not quite teens, so 14, 12, it's great that they can um, they can come here and the activities, they just enjoy it. Um, they have so many, they have outings, they have things that are at the centre, crafts, um, and it's, the kids just love it. And, um, and I love it because I know they're being supervised well and they're having a great time. So today, so they're doing um, the Picasso, Pesto Picasso, and they've been, um, they just love it. There was, um, they're doing pottery, and uh, my kids are really crafty, and they just love having um, the, being able to, being able to do it, doing different crafts, great teachers, um, and, and they just love the support that um, Reesby Workers gives, and uh, it makes it more cost effective. Um, uh, I could not have, we could not afford it if it was the full price. So we really appreciate Risby Workers and all they do. Yeah, we've applied for the club grants every year. We apply for them for different programs. So the money supports all small services of Pula Baru and we use it to bring the community together. And we offer many projects for people in different areas of all ages and backgrounds. So uh, any monies that comes to us we put to very good use. fundraising manager for Wheelchair Sports New South Wales. Wheelchair Sports is dedicated to enriching the lives of those with disabilities through participation in sport. The program that Reedsby Workers Club have kindly supported NET this year is our Junior Wheelchair Sports program. At Wheelchair Sports we provide a number of programs here in Bankstown and throughout the, the, new, the greater New South Wales area. Unfortunately, for many people with disabilities, participation in sport is often hindered by cost. The Junior Wheelchair Sports Program aims to remove this barrier for many kids aged 8 to 20, giving them every opportunity to get involved 
meet other kids, develop themselves through sport and enjoy the life enriching benefits that participation in sport can bring. On behalf of Wheelchair Sports, thank you for getting involved with this program and helping many more kids with disabilities shine through sport.